Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and today we're going to take a look at two ways you can actually view the storage space left on your hard drive. It's one of the common questions people are always wondering, um, you know, how much space do I have left on my hard drive? So the first place you might want to go is on the this PC tab. So you can type this PC and click this PC desktop app and you have a visual of your hard drives. So I've got he that's uh, pretty much empty and I've got the C drive that's got a vis you know just a little bit used 41 used out of 531. You can also right click and go into properties where you'll have a different type of view right here. But you can also because this is a new way of actually viewing things in Windows you can actually use a, the storage app. If you go into storage, you'll see storage system setting. Click there and you will actually have another way of visualizing the storage on your computer. So it's very nice. And also what's very cool is that there are different save locations. So for example, you can say, okay, uh, new documents will save to C drive or whatever. For example, I can say um, new videos will be saved to E drive or if you have multiple drives, if you have uh, SD cards, you can actually, you know, tell where documents, music, pictures and videos are going to be saved in the future. You see here this grayed out little one, it says new apps will save to. This is coming soon and Threshold 2 release in October, you should have the possibility to actually install apps on SD cards. This is going to be a real big thing for everyone that has, for example, a Windows tablet that doesn't have a lot of space. So here, storage, you can also see the storage space used. And if you click on the storage space, that's the interesting thing here, is you'll see also how it's divided. Here it says system reserved uh, 35.5, then apps and games, how many documents, pictures, music, videos, uh, mail, and so on. So it's very interesting because you can see what every part of Windows actually uses. And you can even click, so for example, if you click here, I was looking at temporary files. If I click here, you see you can delete temporary files. Um, you can see the download, view download, remove what's in the download. You can empty the recycle bit from here also. So it's a very complete uh, space of storage and settings. So you can really click on each settings, see how everything is uh, done and what each type of you know document, music, system files and temp files and so on, how to use space, which is very, very nice. So a full set of tools available right here for you. If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, anything you want to know, why not ask away? Maybe you have a video, maybe you have something, a feature, a problem. Uh, please share it with us and we'll try to help you if we can. Uh, we've got a bunch of really cool people that help each other also. It's really nice. Uh, why not give us thumbs up? This helps us in the ratings on YouTube. And hopefully you enjoy the videos and we'll come back.